Yeah. Hello, my faithful new beans. Yes, um, my last two vids have been about me running for the President of the United States. This is true. I have also declared that the tube is paying. Well, for the most part. I'll be getting you some back other backers elsewhere. However, I am going to be switching gears here, as I am a media reviewer. So, that said, I also mentioned that uh, being in the area that I live in, we are host to mermaids. And I have here Sophia again. Hey, Sophia. Yeah, like I said, she's shy. Shy again? Yeah. Yes, Sophia, the shy mermaid. Now, I'm going to give your help a little. As people don't believe mermaids are mammals. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah. Well, you're going to help me with that. What are the criteria for a mammal? Or an aquatic mammal, for that matter. Well, hair. Mermaids have hair. As do I. Alright, that's one thing. This is going to be a little personal. Do um, you breastfeed? Yeah, I know, it's a personal question. I told you it's going to be personal. Do you breastfeed? Ah, okay, yes, it does. Alright, as you can tell, the mermaid's top is basically seashells, but seriously she should be topless due to the fact, how many, um, how many whales or dolphins do you see wearing tops? I haven't any. <laughs> I haven't seen any. The, yeah, okay, speaking of whales and dolphins, the mermaid fits in that category of aquatic mammal. Alright. Other qualities a mermaid has that humans have and other mammals. Well, we found out that she breastfeeds and we found out that she has hair. Let's see, there are at least four other criteria, I believe, for aquatic mammal. Let's see, what would that be? Oh, well, let's get the doctor. There we go. Hello, doctor. This is uh, Dr. Olivia. Oh. I have Princess Sophia and Dr. Olivia. So. Oh, doctor. Now, can you tell us if mermaids are warm blooded? Are mermaids warm blooded? They are. Uh, how do we know this? Well, let's check out The Little Mermaid and uh, Return to the Sea, the sequel. Well, in The Little Mermaid, Ariel is a mermaid who turns into a human, and her daughter is a human that turns into a mermaid. So, mermaids are warm-blooded. And, uh, let's see. Well, you mentioned breastfeeding, and... Uh, the tail. The tail. Okay, let's see. Would that be a fluke? Your tail can fluke? It is a fluke. Okay. Well, mermaids have flukes. So what other animals do we know that have flukes? Oh yes, whales and dolphins, as I mentioned earlier. Is a is the pod is a is a group of mermaids a pod? It is. Okay. Well, she does have a degree in uh, marine biology, after all. After all, she is a mermaid, so she would have a degree in uh, marine biology. I know all about mermaids and other mammals. So, um, with that said, uh, group of a group of mermaids is a pod. Uh, the tail fin is called a fluke. And, um, what else is there? The hair. Oh, yes! The final one! They breathe air. So, uh, yeah. Six criteria for an aquatic mammal, and the mermaid meets all of them. Yeah. 
Mermaids are mammoth people. Deal with it. Oh uh, yes. One other group to the pod. Nipper and McJingles. As you can see, she too is a mermaid. But we have, uh, have an entire pod of mermaids. Yeah. So, deal with the fact that mermaids are mammals. I don't ever want to hear a mermaid being referred to as fish ever again. Because they are mammals. Ciao for now.